The price to stay healthy can be expensive, and one local health care provider wants to make sure that's not the case for you and your family. News 10's Aaliyah Blackburn has more on this growing company in tonight's Health Watch 10. The cutting of this ribbon is a milestone for Matt Burris. We've grown four times and now we're in a 5,000 square foot corporate headquarters and this is our grand opening. Burris is one of the driving forces behind Wellness for Life, an employer-based private medical center. Eight years ago, this was an idea on paper, uh, turned into a PowerPoint. What started as an idea continues to grow, one client at a time. Z, D. These clinics offer a variety of health care for several school corporations as well as government officials within the Wabash Valley, ranging from basic needs such as blood pressure, cholesterol, and even eye exams, all making for an affordable as well as convenient visit to the doctor's office. Hello. Hey, hi. Yeah. How are we doing today? Among the first to try it out is the Vigo County School Corporation, allowing employees and their families to receive medical attention at no cost to them all paid for by the school corporation itself. Uh, we have saved millions of dollars because of this program. The offset of what it would have cost to pay the full price of medications and for that full visit was costing us a lot of money. Stick your tongue out. Say, ah. Uh. Uh. It's a growing trend in the world of health care, and so far it's been well received locally. They've been a godsend for the school system. Making the price to stay healthy not so expensive. Everywhere around us is kind of bought into us and our idea, and, and we've saved uh, the Wabash Valley probably close to $5 million. In Terre Haute, with photojournalists Tony Cassasia and Gary Bryan, I'm Aaliyah Blackburn, News 10. Wellness for Life was started in Terre Haute. Right now, they currently offer services in the Midwest and Virginia. They plan to extend to Colorado and Georgia during the 2015-2016 year.